comprends bien, les conditions de vie sont difficiles pour tout le monde. I understand that life is difficult for everyone, that's true. This is what makes begging a way of life that requires no effort today. You only need to have a physical handicap, know how to sing or know how to get to people, and if you're lucky, you can earn a living. We're in a hard line of work, the audiovisual media. Nowadays, people are against us. Many come quite close to attacking you when they see you with a camera and a tripod filming a report in the city. This is an everyday experience for audiovisual technicians and workers. However much we explain to them that this concerns all of us, they don't understand. They come up and say, no, don't agree to this. These people are going to exploit your image. They're going to manipulate your image and show you naked. They're going to make pornography with you. Things like that. African tradition speaks of a continent marked by oral culture and also by the visual, by the culture of gesture and movement. With this background, television could not but triumph in Africa. However, the high cost of technology and program production make it the prerogative of the few. There is an enormous difference between urban centers and rural areas in terms of access to information. 90% of television sets are located in the cities. While in North America or Europe, there is almost one set per inhabitant, in Africa, there is not even one for every 40 people. There's another subject I've thought of doing, the blind people who are led by child guides. Sometimes these are not their own children. Here children are exploited as well. They are rented out to guide the blind at intersections, traffic lights, in shops, anywhere where there's a crowd. Often, the blind abuse these children. Life is not just about eating and drinking. Life is also about culture. Life is living and knowing what's going on in other places. So I dream of a Mali where the children want to be filmmakers. I dream of a country where we never stop looking at our own images. Listen.